Alakari Uganda. Alakari Uganda. Oh, I Papang in a baby in a yokel. I work it up. Alakari Nakapirit. Alakari Nakapirit. And you can ambassador. Papang in a baby in a yokel. I work it up. Alakari Uganda. This is Southern Karamoja region in Eastern Uganda. The vast drylands of East Africa are home to millions of pastoralists. Karamoja is a marginalized border region of Uganda. It is the fault line between desert to the east and green to the west. Nakapiripiri district is located in southern Karamoja. It is on the cusp of a green belt to the south and a semi-arid rangeland to the north. Nakapiripiri is home to 161,000 people with agriculture and pastoralism as their primary livelihoods. The Karamojong have a rich and unique culture valuing cattle and pastoralism. Climate change is posing a new risk to the Karamojong who rely on ecosystems for their livelihoods. <laughs> Soils are uncovered, winds are high, rain is heavy. All of this is wasting away the fertility of East Africa's arid and semi-arid lands, including Karamoja. We are watching the ecosystems deteriorate year after year. We set out to find a solution that meets immediate needs while contributing to long-term solutions. ACTED has developed the Revive strategy to promote biodiverse year-round food production systems. Revive addresses immediate needs through temporary employment medium-term needs through a more resilient food system. And in the long term, it regenerates the landscape and recharges groundwater. ACTED's approach to community resilience is grounded in the relationship among ecosystems, livelihoods, and markets, all underpinned by effective local governance. Using proven design methods known as permaculture, which had been pioneered over the decades, Earthworks are installed to slow, spread, and soak runoff water and the nutritious topsoil that it carries. Then, the earthworks are used as planting structures to provide vegetation with the water and nutrients it needs. This system requires limited maintenance once it has been established because it mimics the biodiversity of a natural forest. We dig swells in series to rehydrate and regenerate large areas. The result is similar to early cropping or silver pasture. In early 2018, ACTED began the establishment of a rangeland regeneration center just outside of Nakapiripiri town. It features a tree nursery with capacity of over 20,000 seedlings, a small demonstration site, and a basic office. The tree nursery now houses over 20 carefully selected species, including various types of fruit, fodder trees for livestock, and nitrogen-fixing legumes with a focus on indigenous species. The Revive Center serves as a hub for ACTED's regenerative activities in the area, including our first demonstration site just across the road, partnering with our neighbors as champions of the approach. This swell is at the top of our demonstration site. The rocky soil has caused the owners to give up on farming. We are already rehydrating the landscape and rebuilding soils. The erosion control has been immediately visible. The program was carried out in neighboring districts of Nakapiripiri, 
and NAPAC. These demonstrations have shown many benefits and many more are expected to be displayed with time. In 2017, ACTED celebrated 10 years in Karamoja. We have been engaging communities and government to achieve great successes, including field schools, community-based disaster risk management, early warning systems, and cross-border programs. In July 2018, the Revive Center was officially opened with a visit from Ambassador Stephanie Rivoal of France. The opening of the Revive Center marks the next phase of active support to the Karamoja cluster and renews our commitment to regenerating the rangelands of East Africa. From a thematic perspective, the next step is to introduce intensive rotational grazing to the system. From a geographical perspective, we plan to roll out the revived model to strategic points in the Horn of Africa where ACTED is already present.